So, Dean and Andy had their brand with recession experience at Silverstone yesterday. Yeah, Ferrari and Lotus and rain and stuff. I hear Dean began the day how he meant to continue, by oversleeping. That's right, they had to go like well fast up the M40 in that big black French thing. If you believe the instructors, he shouldn't be allowed out of the house, let alone behind the wheel of a car. Andy spent most of the journey wishing he was designing websites instead. It must have been bad. Did they get lost? Of course. But they made it to the track on time? Yeah, after getting lost inside the circuit as well. Andy must have been really grumpy by this point. No, it was okay as Dean bought sausage sandwiches. Just like Ross Braun does for Jensen Button. I hear the Lotus instructors thought Andy was a natural, like Damon Hill. No, Benny Hill. And Dean made a good start by going left out of the pit lane instead of right and nearly driving the wrong way round the track. Instructor asked if he was deaf as he kept ignoring all the advice. Italian supercar next then. Yeah, in really heavy rain. More of a lake. Like steering a boat. Andy will be using these excuses to explain the lap times. Apparently, Dean's plan was to drive like Ray Charles to make Andy look much better. Seems he took it to extremes by spinning the car off the track. The instructor wasn't impressed. He thought Bran Width was the name of a care in the community program for designers with learning problems. So the final hot lap with a professional driver was rained off. Do you think Dean and Andy will be going back another time when the track is dry? Let's face it, it's not likely. Unless it's got an Apple logo on it. Dean can't control it for toffee and Andy would rather eat the toffee.